The Ghanaian Minister of Education, Mr. Yo Osei, has commissioned new set of schools in Ghana as the Kenyan government sent delegates to Ghana to learn more on the STEM education. Trust me, the Kenyan government was mesmerized by what the Ghanaian Educational Minister is doing in Ghana with STEM education and they had to send delegates to find out how is this man doing it. Yes. Ghana for a reason. Ghana, eh, Ghana, ah, Ghana, eh, Ghana, ah, yes, and a whole lot. You're welcome to my channel. I'm Delicious Ami. I talk Ghana, I talk Nigeria, South Africa, Kenya, and all the good stuff relating to them. Do all by liking the video, do all by subscribing to the channel. The Minister of Education, Dr. Yo, say commission. Orakese and Konkoma DA Primary Schools as Bontwawe Constituency as Shanti Region of Ghana. You can see the classroom blocks looking so clean, looking so beautiful. There's even a water supply and also a solar system, meaning if there is no light or no electrical supply, this school will still be able to operate. The next school he commissioned was another girls school at the same Bosome Girls STEM High School. You can see that um, this was opened recently by the Minister of Education and you can see that the students already have something beautiful to present, not just to the minister, but you know also every other person that was present for this event. Let's listen to the girls and hear what they had to say. So it made us to come out to the tea system robot seat as you can see over here. So now with our entertainment industry, we are having the theater and the cinema. But some people find a lot of difficulties when they go to the theater and the cinema. So we come, so we came out to this amazing STEM robot seat. This seat is not just a normal seat. This seat has some capabilities that normal seat doesn't have. In case you go to the cinema, the theater or the cinema, and in case your phone goes down. This seat can automatically charge your phone and also in case that you want to record what the meeting or the video is about when you connect it to the seat it's going to automatically record it for you and you heard from our beautiful girls that this robot set they developed is perfect for cinema experience saying if your phone battery goes low or you're having any issues with your phone charging that this robot set can automatically help you charge it although this is not like um a modern design that can be used in the cinema but if these girls are giving more financial support they'll be able to build a robot set that can be used in the cinema setting i just love how eloquent these girls sound they sound very eloquent they sound very very knowledgeable listening to them you will know that indeed the ghanian educational system has truly transformed them yes let us go straight to the kenyan government that you know went to partner directly with the ghanian government regarding stem education the Kenyan government have seen how beautifully well the Ghanaian students are doing with STEM education and that was why on the 3rd of April 2024, they had to send a representative, that is the foreign minister of you know, affairs, to go and check out how they are doing it. How is Mr. Yo say doing it? That Ghana is moving beautifully well, is expanding. When it comes to robotics, is it just STEM system? And after he had that discussion with, uh, you know, the Ghanaian Minister of Education, he confirmed it that yes, Ghana really knows what they are doing. I couldn't get videos of his visit, but there were written articles where he said, if the world can listen to Ghana, if the world can, you know, just take these ideas from Ghana, that Africa will, you know, be, be be untouchable when it comes to education there are so many things that the that ghana has produced that many people just feel that oh is it just ghana is it just ghana is it just ghana no it's not just ghana it's not just ghana that country has produced a lot of things that if every other african country can keep their pride can keep their oh we are this we are that and listen and you know just ask for the ideas 
Trust me, Africa will be a better place. With this education alone, if other African countries can partner together with Dr. Yo, say and ask him, how are you able to do this? Trust me, with time, every country in Africa will be producing scientists, will be producing robotics. Africa will now become a hub for young engineers. Good, so many things. Is it in the tourism? So many things Ghanaian government are doing beautifully well. Is it in electricity? And it's not as if oh, Ghana is so also such a rich country. That is why they are doing well in some areas. It's just the thought. It's the thought that matters. It's the thought that matters. There's a country that they are main producers of crude oil. And crude oil is not, um, you know, a little money in the market. But that country is still, you know, lagging behind in so many things. Why? The thought is not there. The politicians, the government does not care. The one thing I've noticed is that it is the thought that matters. Ghana, with the little resources they get, they put it together and ensure that they put it back into the country. And that is why you see Ghana is moving forward. Moving forward. Moving forward. Look at them in education. Look at tourism. Even in health. I did a video today. You can watch the video before this one. Where I said foreign students from the University of South Florida came to Ghana to learn about nutrition. Does it mean that Ghana is the only African country? No. But there is something they saw that Ghana is doing differently. And that is why they are all rushing to Ghana. Go around. Almost every foreigner wants to come to Ghana. That's because Ghana tourism is top notch. The security in the country is stable. At least you're sure that you will not just be sitting down in your house and someone will just knock poo, 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 and come and raid you. So that country is doing beautifully well. If other African countries can partner, come together as one, leave all this pride, leave this, leave that, and come together, they'll be able to rob minds, rob ideas, and we will take Africa to the next level. That is just it. Kudos to the Ghanaian government because they are doing something right. If they're not doing something right, the Kenyan government will not send delegates to Ghana to ask the Minister of Education how is it doing it that Ghana is coming out first in, you know, education. Although Kenyan, Kenya is one country that has always looked up to Ghana when it comes to a whole lot of things. The way they run their politics, so many things they put together in that country, it's obvious that they always look up to Ghana. But you can see that they did not hold back. They still put in more effort. To me, like I will always say, it is the thought that matters. The Ghanaian Minister of Education has done beautifully well. I just hope and pray that no matter whoever wins of the next month election, they retain him as a Minister of Education. My lovelies, that's all I have for you in this video. Do all by liking, do all by subscribing. I'm Delicious Army, I talk Ghana, I talk Nigeria, South Africa, Kenya, and all the good stuff relating to them. I'll see you in my next one, guys. Bye bye.